the threat of eminent domain is not fair and negotiated. And I actually said that to the person from EDC who called me on the phone. Once you threaten them with that, how is that a fair negotiation? Because obviously if they hold off and they fight and they fight, and the city uses eminent domain, then they have to go to court to get fair value. And their whole livelihood is in jeopardy. Not only the business owners, but the people who work for them. This whole thing has been a, a joke and a disaster from the beginning. If the city really, really wanted to do development, all they had to do for the past 40 years is put in the infrastructure, put in the roads, put in the sewers, and development would take care of itself over time, and these people could have their jobs and their businesses. And you know something? That would be done at one twentieth of the cost of the taxpayers of this city. And it, especially in this fiscal situation that the city faces itself, finds itself, that we're spending hundreds of million dollars to try and acquire property when we could probably put in the sewers and the roads for $20 million. It's an absurdity. But why does Mike Bloomberg want to do it? Because he wants to give it to one of his rich friends, his rich development friends.